We are government now, we're just picking up the pieces. Oil prices didn't start collapsing last week. They collapsed them from $100 to $80 budget, to $60 to $45, but the country's expenditure pattern had not changed. So don't put that on our doorstep. What we are doing now is preventing an implosion. So one of the reasons why you might hear some comments that um, things are not um, gone a certain way, because we have very carefully, very systematically, been understanding what the situation is so as to make the appropriate response and to preserve some element of sustainability. If we mishandle the economy at this stage, in there are a variety of ways of mishandling an economy, the complaints would be quite different and there will be complaints. So we expect that there would be persons who will not be pleased and they will make comments and especially those who don't have to make the decisions will say whatever, not knowing, because the government has a little more information than most people on these matters at this time. Then why doesn't the government make that information available to all of us? Oh, well, we, we've, made, we've made what was available in September. We said to you, we're coming back to you in March or April, the Minister of Finance has announced that having operated the system for six months, where we are now much better, um, in a much better position, the Minister of Finance will address the Parliament and there's going to be a full debate in Parliament, very much like a, another budget debate, where we're dealing with the actual numbers. Because when we came in, we had certain numbers. Those numbers have changed considerably in more ways than one. So when we come in March 8th, we now will be able to say these are the numbers, this is what we have done, this is what we are going to do. And April is in a much different situation to September. So let's be reasonable.